Philip and I have pretty much woken up in paradise this morning. This is the view that we woke up to, a beautiful, incredibly theatrical, crazy, wonderful bedroom. Philip and I are here to celebrate our third anniversary. Three whole years with that creature. The world's finest table layer. And I nabbed it. Is that my um, official title? Uh, yes, it is. Uh, Having said that, you're not the world's fastest packer and we do actually have to get out of here really quickly. Because uh, we're only here for one night. <laughs> but we're going to the Highlands. You are so slow. Don't you... Look, don't start. You are don't so, start. You're, you're not the fastest packer. I am faster than you. I've nearly finished packing already. So have I. And I haven't even started because I haven't <laughs> unpacked. Because that's how fast you are. Exactly. You don't unpack because you just live out of the suitcase. <laughs> packed. <laughs> Three years of bickering. Three glorious years of bickering is what we have had. And many more years to come. I think many, many more. Okay, no, but I'm... I won't be even holding this. We genuinely have to go. Okay, whilst we faff around, running around packing like crazy for those of us who actually bothered to unpack things... Um, that's your first time, mistake. I am going to leave you with what is actually happening at Laland. Good morning from Laland. It's Marie Cam again. And I thought I would give you the wonderful morning weather report. It's quiet and beautiful and very sunny. Strange weather for October, but we're not complaining. And the flowers are looking beautiful in the courtyard. Um, I don't know how they just keep moving overnight. But I'll take it upon myself to gently <clears throat> position them slightly more appropriate. There we go. Everybody gets a plum. I've been tasked to feed the chickens, the peacocks and Ruby. And the garden is looking beautiful. Oh, and we have the escaped chickens. None of you are getting fed unless you go into the chicken coop. Come on then. Oh, there you go. Pavlina have trained you well. That white thing is a black radish. And then we have some beetroot. Bon appetit. My job here is done. Have a lovely day. The Tales of the Frogs continues. In fact, I think we have a wedding. Here in the kitchen at Lalande, there's flowers, whales, a bouquet. But yeah, I think everybody looks really happy. I think this is a little bit more appropriate. Back in Scotland, this is where we're meeting Nick and Marie. You can see Marie and the back of the elusive Nick's head. We are having breakfast in the most atmospheric place imaginable. Look at the panelling. Are you loving this hotel? Really love <laughs> so good. I mean, it's sad we're not on a train, but I really think that this is right up there. This is really nice. I do insist on always having my croissant pain au la candle lit. I can't believe I've never done that before. I'm starting the day as I mean to go on with a full Scottish breakfast with black pudding, haggis, sausages, poached egg, bacon. There are some tomatoes and mushrooms on there, so it's, it's very healthy. Now we've jumped into the rental car and we're going up to the Highlands to stay in the Fife Arms. We're not the only ones on a big journey because back in France, this is happening. Hello Chateau Diaries, it is Vivian and Simon from Chateau Love. We are about to become the temporary Chatelains of La Lande. We've been asked to stand in because it is a B&B weekend and even though the guests are aware that Stephanie and Philip are not there this weekend. We are the surprise hosts. It's gonna be good. I know, it's, it's gonna, gonna be, nice. be great. It's Here it is. Our okay. chateau away from chateau. <laughs> so Philip has given us strict instructions. Sorry for this, Philip. <laughs> We're doing our best. There's no substitute for Philip. <laughs> never, never a substitute uh, for Philip. I don't know, I think you guys are gonna be fantastic. These are the gorgeous flowers that Marie has done. Yeah. Wow, we're using the beautiful gold yeah. cutlery. I'm so yeah. excited. And if anybody's wondering, I think the Moj, of course.
the great Thank debate, you. which napkin rings? They haven't been used. Oh, uh, new ones. Oh, those are very beautiful, yeah, aren't they? Are. These are really beautiful. They're These kind of cute. like porcelain ones. Oh, the yeah, thing, those are gorgeous. They're too small. They're too small for yeah. the napkins that we normally have. They're quite small, but they are gorgeous. I mean, look at that. And they have yeah. a bunch of different kinds of flowers, too. Okay, those are a you girl's best go. friend. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, wow. I can't. Yes, I can imagine. I can indeed. Ooh. How he looks like. We finally, finally decided on the napkin <laughs> rings. Thank you for the executive decision, Natty. I'm just saying there's leaves over there. Exactly. We need flowers and a little bee. Absolutely. <laughs> I'm going to be a little bit cheeky. Uh -huh. I'm sorry, but I'm in love with the green parrot candles. They are gorgeous. And so I think they need to come on to the Uh huh. No, we have to lift them very, very carefully. Yeah. They're so delicate and so beautiful. Yeah, those are really gorgeous. But they're spectacular. And I think they're really going to make the table. Oh, yeah. Look, look at that. that. Well, if this isn't beautiful, I don't know. And yes, we did end up using the parrot candle thingies. I think they're worth it. Absolutely. What do you think? It's beautiful. Oh. I really like all the candles. Yeah. Beautiful. Wow, this looks amazing. It's a Georgian inspired salad with the walnut, traditional walnut dressing, and then we've got <gasps> nuts. <laughs> oh, yeah, I've got nuts. <laughs> Uh, so, and we've got prunes and plums and a beetroot goat's cheese cream. Mm -hmm. and then we're going to put some goat's cheese on top. Oh my gosh, looks amazing. Yeah. Hopefully, they like it. We have just arrived at the Five Arms and the first thing Philip said was it feels as though we've just stepped into a Christmas movie on some random channel and literally as we got out of the car we started to hear the piping it is a Christmas movie. In October but a Christmas movie nonetheless. All we need now is a sudden snowstorm overnight and to all be snowed in. <laughs> I hope Jerry eventually gets that good on bagpipes. Oh my goodness. I really like what they've done. This is jaw dropping. I am feeling better. Oh, head dropping, I think. This would have been the first moment in the rom com that you feel this is a Christmas oh. movie. That was a great meet cute. The first moment was uh, when I was walking outside and I had my scarf and I was holding the bags. There was a gust of wind. I'd been blown off and then someone would have caught it. It would have been me, darling, obviously. Exactly. I would have caught it. Love the wallpaper. <laughs> This is Nick and Marie's bedroom. This is amazing. Wow. Everything is complimentary. So we have some whiskey and gin for you here. Also on the left hand side, you'll find your tea and coffee facility. We're just in the cellar, darling. Pop round. <laughs> Shop the dog. Oh, I love it. I love the pink. Philip, we've even got ice. No. Yes, there's ice. Quick whiskey? No, no, quick whiskey. We're living in a Christmas movie. <laughs> Thank you very much. This is what comes of carrying on and making the best of it when all of the plans are cancelled. Yeah. And I think we're even having a more wonderful time than we would have had on the train. Cheers. I wonder what's happening at home. Okay, sweetie, come here. Yeah. You have to choose which jewelry you're going to wear tonight. In the antiques jewelry business, this mm -hmm. is a thing. It means that we get to wear it. 
Oh, okay. And then I'm going to sell it. They're pretty. I know. They're very chateau, aren't they? One is a swan, and then we've got the two birds, slightly different sizes. And then I thought this little chap, I thought he looked very autumnal. Attitude, isn't he? That's beautiful. Oh, my God. Yeah, that's really pretty. I know. So I think we're going for this one here. It's a cameo of two women. Uh-huh. So this is like having you and Isabella oh. on, my, on my lapel. Yeah. That's gorgeous. Okay. And now it's time for me to get ready. I've got my jewelry picked out as well. It's almost Christmas time. I'm pulling out the Christmas jewelry already. Okay, very good. <laughs> and amazingly, I found this matching brooch that can be hung in all sorts of different ways. So, of course, it's the Chateau de la Lande, so I have to be a little bit blingy. Um, I wish I had Stephanie's wardrobe. Oh, yeah, good, 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 good. Da, 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 this is a dream team in the kitchen. Look at this. Um, let's, let's do that one. Okay, okay, let's finish with that. Oh, let's be careful. Okay. okay. Am, am I allowed to show this beautiful starter? <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, yay. Is this ready? Yeah, it's that one. That's oh, my goodness gracious. Mm -hmm. Apparently, we, we are having tonight. Not very in chocolate. <laughs> oh. Make it autumn and forest. Oh. <laughs> Those were three of my favorite things, That's actually. <laughs> you look gorgeous. Why, thank you. Is this like a shawl or like... Oh, Antique like kimono. Ooh, this is so pretty. I love this. We are all about the antique kimonos, and I uh -huh. saw Philip last week in Porto. We went shopping, and we couldn't resist antique kimonos. Uh, this is not from there, but yes. Well, it's gorgeous. It does look beautiful, doesn't it? Yeah, it's gorgeous. <laughs> nice. Well, how are you? How are you? It's just lovely seeing you guys. I'm a bitch. <laughs> the main course is a duck breast with a chocolate quince and balsamic sauce and a roasted quince that Pavlina and I kept insisting that I use. And we have some more of the sauce if anyone would like, so I'll put it on the, on the table for you. Good, thank you. Thank you very much. It smells thank you. I just got a text from Philip. He's wishing us all a wonderful evening. Yes, to absent you. friends, hey, yes. Hello. Here, 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 here. <laughs> This is the most beautiful presentation. I've got a bit of lobster. And Marie has also the pigeon. I'm doing the Steph commentary. <laughs> because you want to remove the pigeons at La Lande. So this is your way of protesting by eating pigeon here. I'm doing the same thing. I'm doing my bit as well. You know, I love them. We had the dark chocolate for the main. So now we've got a white chocolate mousse. Mm. And then you have what I'm calling the forest floor granola. Thank you. Thank you. What did you just call this dessert? I called it Nick the Tree Surgeon. It's got the forest floor granola. Nick the Tree Surgeon dessert. Thank you. Well done. <laughs> that was the best meal. But the thing I'm most excited about this evening is Philip's given me my three year anniversary gift. It's the bag and the shoes. I love them, Philip, so much. You look beautiful. Thank you. I'm going to sleep like a log because I hate far too much. <laughs> so bed.